Hey, that's pretty cool. Call call and voted. That is a five day streak for a free vote key and a free mystery box. Kinda cool actually, and I didn't know. You actually get, wait, who just got a bow, jeez. Anyways, you actually get day streak points, which you can then spend on other things. So that is 12 more vote crystals I can just add to my bank. Also, I get a red vote streak point, so four more five streaks and I get a free ultra box, I think. Yeah, real quick, gotta exchange all 12. That key is actually awesome though, because achievement democracy five, I have to open up five of the vote chests. When I do though, I get two free mystery boxes, so kinda cool. And as well, at the moment in time, I do have 43 vote points, so at 55, I am gonna buy myself the vote streak key, so that'll help the achievement even better. Mystery box, what do we got, dude? Come on, banger or foe? Okay. Vote chest gives me. Okay. What, you... what do you mean, dude? Either way, that vote key gives me democracy too, so open two vote chests, bada bing, free mystery box, and a vote mystery box. What did I fuck off? Miss Diddy box again, come on? It's actually some nasty rewards. Wait! That's actually so good, I don't have any- Yeah! I've got like 200 KC on Arams, I've only got two robe tops. That is my first, technically my first staff that I can autocast Ancients with. That's pretty sick, I'll take that. Easy. Really? 57 KC for another drop at Serb? That's four drops now. And 57, but not a single boot crystal. Stone, two jars, shield left half. Sick! And that's the last of that task. 70 KC so far. I do believe Serb is one of the bosses for 100 KC requirement on Comp Cape. And plus I want some boot crystals. Either way, next Slayer task is gonna be... Honestly, I should probably do the Nightmare, but I'm not feeling it right now. Not doing Corp. Arma. I'll do that, actually. 35 Arma. I'm pretty sure I just Blowpipe and Barrage of Minions. Should be fairly easy. Okay, so that's going to be the gear setup, although... I don't have a book yet. How have I not done Horror from the Deep? Should be fairly easy. I'm maxed. Mini games, Horror from the Deep. Let's get it. Hello, hello. And let's go kill the Dagonoth. I'm assuming it's going to be the same as old school with the different combat styles. Where are you at, beastie? Not really sure why it took 15 episodes to do this. By the way, it goes air, water, fire, earth, and then I believe range. Later, bitch. I defeated the beast, I shall return to Jossic. Take the box. Access to god books, ability to kill the mother, and two XP lamps. XP lamps, by the way, I'm just chucking onto agility because it's probably the skill that I don't want to train the most. Oh wait, sick. Wait, you don't even need the pages. Although, it costs one rusty casket. Book of Darkness is the best mage one, and I do need mage at the moment. Best range is Book of Law, best tribrid is unholy, best prayer bonus I think is holy. Eventually I will end up grabbing them all, but that is plus 10 magic. And a bit of prey bonus. Sick. Yeah, I figured. Every other Dagonoth kill is going to be another casket, so technically I'll have to kill... Six? But for the meantime, there's two books. Uh, next, I'm honestly going to go with a Book of Law, because that's going to be best range. If I use an ACB, plus 10 range. Ah, Hespori, shit. This, anyways, is pretty much going to be my gear setup for Armadil. Got the range, got that, got the Blood Barrage, should be alright. Presets real quick, new save, Arma... And let's do Hespori. Come on, anything from Hespori today, dude? I would actually be Loki super happy if a Kronos was planted. Come on. Bro, I've literally never gotten a rare seed. And it's looking like double Slayer points active. And another Gulp, or I'll take that. And double boss points, I'll take it. 1 in 67 on drops from Arma, by the way. And about 1 in 460 on minions. Come on, wish us luck. I'm kind of curious if I can hit Kree. Am I actually just gonna blood barrage an AFK Armadil? That's fucking sick! Alright, wish us luck. Oh. Alright, just uh, doing some gem rocks for a bonus loot and double clue scrolls and get my first double onyx drop. That's kind of weird, but I'll take it, I guess. By the way, I didn't actually notice inside of the achievements, mining gem rocks is actually counting towards mining three. Another achievement towards comp, I'll take it. Hey, more clues. Alrighty. Somebody planted a Kronos. Planted? Planted? Hello? 
real quick gonna go do these nine masters please give me some fucking mimics i still do technically have a half hour extra of this but i'd much rather do some tob dude come on watson nine masters in one mimic feels bad trash that's kind of cool that is trash that is trash a bucket helm what the fuck okay i got the ring of coins that's that's cool black demon mask and lesser demon i'll take it dude sick Anyways, we off to TOB. Wish us luck, boys. That's bad, man. I got three stacks of dwarf weeds. GL. No purple again. Feels bad. And a bunch of junk. Come on. Purple. Not today. And some more trash. Snapegrass is pretty pog, actually. Good luck. Got planked out by the fucking portal. Where I belong. Any purples today? That is 25 KC, halfway to it. And a whole lot of nothing. Trash. I think we can do one more in this time to do raid key events. So I'm going to gear back up real quick and catch you guys at the next box. And last of the sesh. Please, purple. Feels bad. A whole ass chrono seed without even seeing a purple, dude. That is actually so sad. Unlucky as fuck, dude. Either way, it's another six-ish raids done. I am pretty much halfway towards TOB champion for another free ultra mystery box. That'd be sick. Although, inside of that raid, I kind of noticed something. I want myself the Crystal Halibird. Inside of the boss point shop, remember, it's 5k. I'm currently sitting at 4705, so I am going to go back to bossing. And I know, before you guys comment down below, it is 1 in 85 from the Elf Warriors, but I've killed like 500. And like, 5k boss points, I'm really not going to spend it on much else. So, I might as well. Anyways, for the meantime, boss task of Sarah? I should. I have to for comp, but I really don't want to. Alright. Like, 8 skips of shit tasks later, we get 35 General Grador. Off to Bandos we go. And I guess the Crystal Halibird at Bandos would be pretty sick too. Anyways, same method as last time. Pretty much barrage the minions to heal back. Melee the boss, and pretty AFK. And sadly, no bonus drop rate at the moment. Plus, we do have double boss points, but... Wish us luck. Off we go. Hey, that's pretty sick. Somebody just planted an Iasaur seed. 100% drop rate. I'll take that. Also, realizing after I finish this task, I'll have over 100 Bandos KC. So technically, for comp, I won't have to come back here. Eventually, I'll still need to to get the BCP and the pet and the hilt off the drop table, but mainly going for comp right now. That's kind of sick. Nothing too special at Bandos so far, but I am going to jump home and contribute 50 mil towards the 20% drop rate on the well. Hopefully somebody tops that off. I do need a bit of my cash, but the extra drop rate's kind of pog. Bro, I just got three back-to-back -back Venonatus, then Sirachnus. I don't want to kill fucking spiders, dog. Dude. I'm almost at a point, man. This is a... What? This is so bad. I All right. Partially because I'm literally out of Slayer points, but 35 uh, Thermonuclear Smoke Devils, and I'm sitting on 29 Slayer points. That was a lot of fucking skipping. I'm just gonna assume Blood Barrage them? Wait, 1 in 167 for an occult? Holy shit. What do you mean? The small ones are 1 in 200. If this boss is shit, dude, I swear to God. All right, let's go check it out. Plus side, I can cannon them. Kind of curious on how many boss points. Although, that is super fucking AFK. Bro, hello? Are you kidding me? I got the fucking Thermi pet. Hello? Okay. Um... Not what I wanted, but 14kc. Gimme, gimme. God damn it, dude. Bro, what the fuck is that? What is that? That's from a mini dude. The chain body. Eh, that's 1k FOA. I'll take it. But what do you mean? I'm here for a special necklace. What the fuck, man? 
every drop but the fucking drop I need. That is gonna be another Slayer task done, I think? Yeah. No drops, but I kinda have an idea. Like I said, the necklace from the small ones seem to be pretty common, and there's a shit ton over here. And multi-combat as well. Hopefully this works. Alright, that's about it for me. Pretty much the end of 100% drop rate anyways. And about 110, 120kc so far. Kind of a rip, no occult, but I got a new pet and a new D-chain body. Fucking sick, mate. Real quick, I am just jumping over to skill. I've got a few extra onyxes. And bada bing. Three furies. I like it. Those are another 1k foe each. And real quick, just doing another foe run. Bunch of goodies. Pretty much mostly dupes, honestly. Another master real quick. Four. Feels bad, man. Tassies, 16.5k. Three furies. Bando's boots are 1100. Holy. Dude, the same as... That's actually so bad. And there we are. Back over 50k. Like I said, probably gonna skip out on the Shadow Archer for the next one. I'm gonna save up for the click to get myself a passive 5% drop rate. And then after that, I'll go back to the Shadow. Eight attempts. No Archer. Fucking hurts, man. Real quick. And the boss point shop, we have 5,000 points. Buying the crystal weapon seed. How does this work? What do, what do I do with it, though? Uh... Uh... Big shouts to Wraith, Tally TV, Crystal Warriors, and speak to the trader. So to create the halibut, I need 10 mil coins and the crystal. Bada bing, Crystal Halley. That thing is such a good PVM weapon, honestly. Ah here for 1kc, misclicked on a Guthix, and got the staff. Perfect! If you don't remember, that is needed for the Majorina 2 achievement to actually kill them all, so I'm only camping here for those and maybe some more keeps? They're only like 1 in 30, shouldn't be that bad. Hey, Zami staff coming in not much longer. Hey, Saridoman staff. Bada bing, that's all three staffs. So for the actual achievement, I'm pretty sure literally all I have to do is run around the wilderness and kill the Zami boss with Zami, Sarah boss with Sarah, Guthix with Guthix. Simple as that. But since I am here, I still got a bit of supplies. I'm gonna camp for a little bit. Hopefully I grab a different cape, cause this thing is fucking ugly. Honestly, Sarah or Zami at this point, I'd be happy with. All right, that's about 120 KC. That kind of scared me. No luck on the cape though. And another kind of rip, the forums are down at the moment. So I don't necessarily know where any of these wildy bosses are. I am just gonna wait till they come back up, honestly. Save myself just running around aimlessly. But either way, Three staffs. Whenever those are back up, that'll be another achievement complete for four lamps and ten mil cash. Sick. Real quick, daily reward wizard for two vote crystals. With that brings us to 51, so technically on tomorrow's vote, I'll be able to buy myself another vote street key. As well, real quick, just opening up a few junk clue scrolls. Doubt I'm gonna grab anything. Ah, alright, infinity boots and mage book. They are dupe, but if I get a dupe eternal crystal, that's a bunch of free foe. Cool. I'll take that. But did that because Treasure Trails 3 is now completed. Another achievement, but more importantly, ya boys got the flippers! My favorite fashionscape item dude, 1 in 66 from the Mogers. Probably done that grind like 30 times on old school. And ya boys got a spade. Real quick, I do want to go through my requirements because as we know, pretty much the only goal at the moment of mine is comp cape. So all achievements is honestly going to be the big one. I'm probably 30 cocks away from completing that. I am 74 Tob away, still gonna do Nightmare and Corp. Hydra, probably gonna jump in too soon. Serb's almost done, Kraken's almost done, Bando's almost done. Arma's almost done, gotta do Sarah, Zami, and then we got a Comp Cape. Big issue though is all of that. Yeah, there's quite a few missing. I don't mind doing them, the only real issues is like, fletching and farming. Just a bit of AFK skilling at the end of the day.